Hi everyone, we have a new feature that I'd like to show you how to use. It's our eFlyer system. eFlyers can be used as attachments on email blasts, on emails that you send to your clients, or you can actually print them and put them in your for sale signs or use them at open houses. So we have many templates in the back end that you can use. Let me show you how this works. Up at the top of the tap, top navigational area in your Prime Seller Leads back end admin area is a drop down for eFlyers. If you mouse over that and click on Manage eFlyers, you'll come to the eFlyers section. In the top right hand corner, click on Add eFlyer, and then you'll see here the flyer description. You can put anything you like in here, but let's go ahead and put a property address. For the flyer type, we have two different types of flyer types right now, sales and rentals. So I'm going to choose sales. And for the MLS number, you don't have to enter it. However, there is a spot on the flyer for the MLS number, so I'm going to go ahead and enter one here. Down at the bottom where it says template type, you'll see that it currently, right now, we have eight different templates available. We have many more that are under construction that will be added here shortly, but for right now we have these eight. So you can see that there's many different ones with different amounts of agents and different amounts of photos in the flyers. So I'm just going to choose template number one for one agent and four photos. Okay, now we've got our flyer template up. So now we can really make changes to it however we want. So if we go up here, if you click on it, you'll see that you can change this text. Okay, click Save. And we can also go ahead and change the photos. So you can upload as any photos that you like. So I'm just going to run through and put some photos into each of these spots. Here's photo number three. We can also change this text down here at the bottom. So I'm just going to say save that. We can also put uh, your picture here. So we'll just upload a picture. As you can see, you can change the phone number, the email address, the website address, any of the content on here you can change. Here, as you can see, where the MLS number was automatically entered. So, really, any of this content here you could change, the features, any of it. So, when you're done and you like the looks of your flyer, just make sure everything looks good. You just click Submit. That's going to go ahead and save your flyer. Now, after your flyer is saved, let's go back to the eFlyers menu up top. Let's click on Manage eFlyers. And you can see your flyers that are created are listed here. So now we do have a couple choices once this is done. The thing to do at this point to create a graphical image of that flyer is this little camera icon underneath the actions column. You can see if you click there, you'll create an image. So let's just go ahead and click that. Just wait a second for the image to be created. Okay, now the image has been created. To download the image, you simply just go ahead and click on the new icon here that says click here to download the image. You'll see now that we have a JPEG image of the flyer that we created. So like I said, right now we have eight templates that you can use to create your flyers. Uh, we have about 25 more under development that will look beautiful that all of you can use as well. 
and we'll be adding in more features to this as well in the coming days, such as the ability to change the font size, the font colors, the background colors, all of that. So as always, if you have any questions at all, please let us know. I hope all of you enjoy this new feature.